Hi, and welcome to Crazy Mommy Shit. As a novice griller, I try to stick to grilling foods that are nearly impossible to mess up. So today, I'm grilling corn on the cob with the husk still attached. First, soak the corn with the husk still attached. Preferably, soak the corn for at least an hour before placing the corn on the grill. However, if you're short on time, soak the corn for at least 10 minutes. By soaking the husks, it prevents the husk and ultimately the corn from catching fire and burning. Next, gently pull back the husk. Remember, we are cooking the corn with the husk still attached. Remove the silk. So the silk is that fine string-like layer between the husk and the actual corn. There are many, many ways to remove the silk, but I've found success in either dampening my finger or a paper towel and rubbing it against the kernels. Next, season the corn. While the corn is exposed, season your corn. We typically use kosher salt, chili powder, smoked paprika, ground cumin, and pepper. My spice concoction provides a little bit of heat, but you should use whatever seasoning combination that works best for you and your family. Finally, we're gonna add either one to two pats of butter or some olive oil. Next, we're gonna close the corn within the husk. Place the corn on a preheated grill. Cook for about 20 to 25 minutes, rotating every five minutes. It's important to recognize that the cook time is dependent on the grill type and the grill temperature. For me, I was able to cook my corn for 20 to 25 minutes because my grill temperature was at about 500 degrees Fahrenheit. Ultimately, you're gonna have to check and adjust with respect to your grill type and the grill temperature. Take your corn off the grill, take the husks off, and enjoy some delicious grilled corn. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram and subscribe to our YouTube channel.